What's good everybody, Mr. Nike SB6 back again, 188th Nike SB video. I have a new pickup for you guys. I know it's been a lack of videos from my channel, but I am back and I will be giving you a lot of content from my channel, sneaker wise and just stay in the life videos in general, so stay tuned. Uh, I was on vacation, I had something very special happen in my life. If you follow me on Instagram, you already know what that is. There will be a nice day in the life video coming up for that. It is Nike SB's Black History Month sneaker, and they based it off the homie Chuck Treese. And the dude is uh, pretty much the first African American to go on the Thrasher magazine, along with his band McRad, thus the name McRads. A very nice sneaker, very detailed shoe, with um, some embroidery work, the insoles having the print on it, just crazy. Uh, the embroidery work has two uh, years on it, one saying 86, which is on the left shoe, one saying 84, which is on the right shoe. 86 is the year of uh, his first album dropping with the band McRad, and 84 is the year that the Thrasher magazine dropped. This is the sneaker, the McRads, a very clean shoe. Let's stop fucking around and get into the review. And here goes your official colors on the box. Okay, on the insole, uh, it has a very nice picture of the man himself. I believe that's the Thrasher magazine cover. And as you can see, the laces that are right there are the ones that came on it, which are red. I stuck with the extra laces, which are black. The outsole of the shoe, pretty basic, all white, which your Nike SB hit right there in the middle, and that is in green. To the midsole of the shoe, you have a black midsole, green stitching going around the whole shoe, and then you have that top piece, which is green. I like when the SB does that. You rarely see it with SB throwing another color on the midsole. Pretty basic for your toe box, a very nice premium leather, which is in white. Around your toe, you have that black suede, and on the right shoe, you have the 84, which is when the Thrasher magazine came out, and then on the left shoe, you have the 86, and that is when his first album came out with his band Mick Rad. On the mid panel of the shoe you have canvas material. On top of that you have the swoosh which is yellow and that is suede with that uh, double layered swoosh and the outline in black suede. Always nice when a Nike SB throws a double layered swoosh. Black suede for the eyelids, pretty basic. Onto the back panel. Back panel of your shoe, you mainly have black suede. Up above from that, you see this uh, green canvas material. You have your yellow pull tab right there, which is suede. The embroidery work on the back, which you see, which is red, is pretty much based off the cover of the Thrasher magazine, and that is in red, stitched in, that goes all around the back panel. On to the tongue of the shoe. Good to see that they didn't use mesh material. Kind of gets boring with the mesh material after a while. Uh, you have a white tongue with a black tag. And instead of throwing Nike SB, it says Mick Rad on the tags. And uh, the Mick is on the right shoe and the Rad is on the left. Mick Rad's on feet. A very clean sneaker. Definitely a lot of detail on this shoe. Pretty basic on the colors. Definitely went well with the theme. Make reds. Wanted to give a shout out to my homie Keenan Grimley. I apologize if I pronounce your name wrong. Follow him on Instagram, real cool dude. Okay, I reviewed your Mick Rads. A very clean sneaker. Call me Mick 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 B Rad if you want. Plenty more videos to come. Stay tuned in. I'll see you guys next time. Rate, comment, subscribe. Peace.